Welcome to today's special coverage. We begin with some significant updates from the front line in Ukraine, where the Ukrainian armed forces continue to display resilience and tactical expertise in their battle against Russian aggression. From armored tank assaults to precise drone strikes, the Ukrainian military has demonstrated its ability to neutralize Russian advances. Let's take a closer look at the latest developments. In a daring operation, a lone Ukrainian tank from the 58th Separate Motorized Infantry Brigade directly engaged Russian forces in the Kursk region. The target, a Russian command and control center, which was reportedly housing drone operators and ammunition supplies. In a bold move, the Ukrainian tank charged forward, delivering direct hits to the compound and causing devastating destruction. Footage from the first-person view of the tank crew showed close encounters with RPG attacks from Russian forces, but the tank withstood the blasts, narrowly escaping several missed strikes. After effectively neutralizing the command center, the tank withdrew safely, leaving the Ukrainian crew unharmed and the vehicle intact. This heroic operation not only disrupted the enemy's command structure, but also sent a clear message of Ukrainian determination on the battlefield. In a fierce and pivotal battle along the Oskil River, Ukrainian forces, led by the 92nd Mechanized Brigade, alongside the Achilles Unit, Berevi Brigade, and the 77th Separate Air Mobile Brigade, successfully repelled a major Russian armored assault. The Russian offensive, comprised of 14 BMP-2 infantry fighting vehicles and three T-80 tanks, aimed to seize a critical crossing over the Oskil River. The recent floods in the area had made the river an even more important strategic point, as Russian forces sought to cut off Ukrainian defenders from the left bank and secure control of the region. As the Russian forces advanced, the Ukrainian defense quickly mobilized, utilizing a well-coordinated combination of modern warfare tactics. Surveillance drones continuously monitored the battlefield feeding real-time intelligence to Ukrainian commanders, while anti-tank guided missile, ATGM teams positioned themselves for optimal engagement. Simultaneously, artillery units unleashed precise barrages on Russian armored columns, halting their momentum. The results were devastating for the Russian assault. Eight BMP-2s were completely destroyed by a mixture of drone strikes, ATGMs, and artillery fire. All three T-80 tanks, a backbone of the Russian armored force, were also eliminated during the intense engagement. The remaining six BMP-2s sustained severe damage, rendering them inoperable and leaving Russian infantry exposed on the battlefield. Russian infantry suffered heavy casualties during the failed attack, with 21 soldiers killed and 26 wounded. Despite their attempts to breach Ukrainian lines and capture the vital crossing, the Russian assault was decisively thwarted by the well-executed Ukrainian defense. The Ukrainian forces not only neutralized the immediate threat, but also demonstrated the Oskil River's critical role as a natural defensive barrier. This victory reinforced the strategic value of the river in the ongoing conflict, highlighting Ukraine's ability to defend key positions while delivering substantial blows to Russian forces. The repelled assault also underscored the importance of drone and missile coordination, ANSWIC, proving once again how Ukrainian forces are utilizing advanced tactics to outmaneuver and overpower their adversaries. The Ukrainian 4th Mechanized Brigade once again demonstrated its mastery of drone warfare. Two Russian soldiers were spotted in the ruins of destroyed buildings, attempting to conceal themselves from Ukrainian forces. The Ukrainian Hunter drone team launched an assault, targeting the Russians with precision. One Russian soldier was neutralized after the drone successfully dropped its ordnance. The second soldier tried to hide inside a nearby destroyed building, thinking he had found cover. However, the Hunter drone, displaying remarkable precision, flew directly through the window of the building and neutralized the remaining target.
Meanwhile, in another remarkable operation, the Ukrainian Reg drone team identified two Russian 152mm Mesta B howitzers engaging Ukrainian positions. In response, a kamikaze hunter drone was dispatched, delivering a successful hit that destroyed the first howitzer. Russian soldiers, realizing their position had been compromised, attempted to flee. Unbeknownst to them, surveillance drones were already monitoring their movements. Ukrainian forces relayed the coordinates to their artillery units, which launched a strike on the fleeing soldiers, destroying their hideout in a nearby residence. The REG drone team continued its success by identifying another Russian howitzer, this time camouflaged with tree branches and greenery. Artillery fire was directed at the second position, resulting in the destruction of the second Mesta B howitzer. These operations demonstrate the deadly efficiency of Ukraine's drone and artillery coordination in neutralizing long-range Russian artillery positions. Russian troops in Kursk are resorting to increasingly desperate measures to evade detection. Using tree branches, straw, and even carpets, they have attempted to conceal their vehicles from Ukrainian surveillance drones. But despite these efforts, Ukrainian forces remain one step ahead. The REG drone team has been actively destroying Russian vehicles, including Jeeps and BMPs, which were spotted attempting to hide in various locations. Bukanka vans, rigged with protective grills, were also targeted, but none of these makeshift defenses could withstand the precision of Ukrainian hunter drones. Russian soldiers, aware of the constant surveillance, have resorted to using civilian vehicles in an attempt to blend in and escape detection. However, Ukrainian drones, equipped with sophisticated tracking capabilities, continue to expose and destroy these vehicles. In several instances, Russian soldiers tried to take refuge in forests and nearby villages, only to be relentlessly pursued and neutralized by Ukrainian forces. The eagle eyes of Ukrainian drones have become an inescapable force for the Russians in the Kursk region. These recent operations underscore the unwavering resolve of Ukrainian forces in defending their homeland. From tanks engaging enemy positions to drones providing both surveillance and precision strikes, the synergy between various military units is proving to be a powerful force against Russian advances. The situation on the ground remains fluid, but the effectiveness of Ukrainian tactics is clear. They are successfully repelling Russian forces and continuing to secure key strategic points. The world watches as Ukraine defends its sovereignty, and today's operations serve as a testament to the courage and capability of the Ukrainian armed forces. Stay tuned for more updates as the conflict unfolds. Thank you for joining us today.